Hello. Tonight we will be playing some Gears 5, which has just become available. Go through some campaign and see how she plays. Have to turn my inverted on here soon. Some latest gameplay updates. Why not? Lieutenant Delmont Walker, reporting for duty. Yo, Baird, how long is it gonna stay dark in here? Wait, dark? Where are you? Where you told me to go. Oh dear, miscommunication. Dave, uncloak. All right, can you at least see Dave? Yeah, I see Dave. <laughs> All right, working on getting that module powered up. Could you just hurry? Ah, lights are glitched. Iris, open the doors. Certainly, Damon. What the hell, man? Hey, we had to get light in that box somehow, didn't we? Hang on, we'll set you down. Can't say I'm a fan of Del. I don't like him oh, before. Tell me again why you got me out of my perfectly good bed for this. All right. I want to upgrade our security bots for combat against the swarm. Everything you do, the sensors on your armor will record. Man, you think your bot's gonna be able to compile my moves? Uh, yeah, I do, actually. <clears throat> nice landing, Bear. Thanks. We need to calibrate those sensors and just follow Dave. Good, now keep up with them. Man, I could be having brunch right now. Your waffles will be there when we're done, kid. Got a caliber, oh, kid. Make me actually stay next to him. Dave. Wonderful! I, I love it. Anyway, uh, now hit the keypad. Excellent! Iris, bring in the next module. Incoming, Damon. All right. Step one for combat-ready DPs is making them use and understand cover, like you would. <laughs> to the next piece of cover, please. Swap to the 
adjacent piece of cover. Perfect. We got it. Now hug that wall and move left. Pretend you're taking fire. Pew, pew, pew. <sighs> okay, could we stay? Good. Data's clean. Now, let's make it more interesting. Our DB's gotta learn that enemies can still hit them in cover from an angle. Using the cover, break Dave's line of sight so they can learn how to move like a real gear. All right, I'm down. Dave, bring up your targeting laser. <laughs> oh, you can't find me. <laughs> oh, you missed me. <laughs> Game in the series. This next? level of training shouldn't be module. necessary. Finally, shooting module has been placed. Okay, grab a lancer, the cog's most trusted and versatile firearm. Man, how could you not trust something with a chainsaw bayonet? All right, kid. Incoming guardians. Take down their shields and destroy them. Any guardian online. Okay, now aim down your sights. DBs love to hip fire. We need to change that. I know how to fire a gun, man. right? Now let's try using blind fire to destroy them while keeping yourself protected in cover. <laughs> now that's good data. Put that in your face. For some goddamn reason, ABs have trouble nailing a perfect reload. Show them how it's done. Oh, perfect. That's got to be solid data there. Not bad, not bad. But let's up the challenge. Can you take down a moving target? Give it on my person. I'll be able to help you. Cut. Easy peasy. Good. Let's move on to explosives training, shall we? Grab some frag grenades from the rack. You sure you want DBs tossing frags around? Uh, have you met the swarm? All right, now equip it. Iris, bring in some volunteers for Lieutenant Walker to blow up. Yes, dear. Er, Damon. Yes, Damon. Uh, you didn't hear that. Uh, uh Baird? 
How does blowing up DBs help train them? They're all custodial units. I was gonna strip them for parts anyway. Okay, just like when shooting, keep your head down and blind toss the grenade. Citizen safety concerns deactivated. One down. <laughs> Boom! With my eyes closed. Great. Now open your eyes and target the rest. Just wind up, aim, and release. Grab more frags if you run out. That's one! Behind you. Terrific. This module's almost complete. You ready for a live fire exercise? Does Marcus like tomatoes? An emphatic yes. Grab some fresh ammo and frags, then get back into cover. Ah. These Shepard DBs are using shock rounds. Take them out. No problem. Aim for the head. They'll go down quicker. Quick is good. Let's start. And try mixing things up between firepower and explosives. I'll use the same thing. Good to see you, citizen. Engage. Reload commencing. Ah! I see why you need so much data. These things can't shoot for shit. Unlawful citizens acquired. Excellent work. Data looks good. Ready to move on? Sure. Why not? Great. Now for a quick exercise in field medicine. Iris, bring in the patient. He is joining us now. What's wrong with him? Looks fine to me. Dave? What a pleasant day we're having. <laughs> having the roof now, baby. And help him up, Del. You know, for science. Science. I got you. I got you. Your assistance is most appreciated. Now, word of warning. This next one's gonna sting a bit. What are you talking about? Dave? DB, help him up. Damon, this is not part of the training protocol. Are you instead having fun with Lieutenant Walker? Iris! Ignore her, kid. She's uh, on the fritz or something. Citizen, it appears you need aid. Oh, I was trying to self revive oh, it and I let him. Hey, kid, do me a favor and scrap that custodial unit for me. Just use your Lancer's chainsaw. Really? Damn, man, that's cold. Right bumper to use chainsaw. Find that metal cannot be good for that blade. Thanks, kid. Don't worry, I'll make sure he gets recycled. Head over to Dave when you're ready to continue. Well, might as well. Brunch is over anyway. That's the spirit. Iris, initiate the next training module. Preparing now, Damon. Grab a Nash or shotgun off the rack. Ooh, I already know I'm gonna like this. Tell me pop. Clear out those shepherds. Need as much close quarters data as I can get. Watch me work, baby. Citizen, that Nash is made for close range combat, kid. So feel free to get in their faces. Good work. Oh, and Iris, 
We're gonna need cleanup in Module 7. Anyway, ready for the hand-to-hand -hand module? Come on, when you're born ready, you ain't got to get ready. Uh, yeah. Just follow oh, Dave. Yikaboo. Welcome to the hand-to-hand -hand combat module. First up, use your combat knife to take out the deactivated DP. That seems a little unfair, but okay. Citizen safety concerns deactivated. While it's down, let's grab some finishing move data. What a double shot! Impressive. Robots aren't as much fun. You don't get nearly as many right, coming up next, some gooey bits from robots than you do Let's do it. flesh. Okay, take cover behind the next shepherd. Good to see you, citizen. And now give it a yank. And insert knife. Almost feel sorry for. Learning comes sacrifice. Line it up, mantle over, knock it back. And insert knife. And I'm sensing your pass. Okay, now let's go. as many gooey bits as there should be. I need to find something flesh to stab. Slaughter, man. Oh, really? Well, what do you say? We grab some data from a fair fight. Come on, man. This is me we're talking about. You don't have enough robots to make this a fair fight. Oh, yeah? We'll see. Gear up and we'll get started. Shot grenades, retro lancer, enforcer. What the hell is the talent? Oh, it's a handgun. That's sexy. Oh, we, I would much rather use a long shot than the Nasher. I know it's sacrilege, but... That's how the cookie crumbles. Iris, initiate combat simulation 12. Damon, combat simulation 12 will provide a gear as skilled as Lieutenant Walker with minimal challenge. Iris, I knew I loved you. Okay. Simulation 13. Higher challenge, better results. Worst case, Dell's in the hospital for like a week or two. Wait, ho hospital what now? Oh, you'll see. Just get to Dave and we'll get hospital. started. Hospital. I say, bring on the hospital. I don't care if I have teammates. Iris, bring in their opponents. The incoming enemy units won't be holding back, so get me data I can work with. Let's go, fellas. Team Dell all the way. Targets acquired. Attack, reload, initiated. Attack, reload, initiated. 
Six, ready to start gears. And you have to five different ways. Of course, you can always come back here if you need a refresher. Nope, I'm good. What do we have under extras? Thanks for completing the Guild and Marcus Challenge in Gears 4. I got Foot Tap Expression, Guild and Marcus Banner, and Guild and Marcus. Completing Guild and Weapon Skin Challenge. Cool. I'm, I, I, I may have, uh, I, I may have played a little bit of Gears 4, possibly. Previously on Gears. State of the Universe. Let's check this out. On planet Sera, things were not always peaceful. For year after bloody year, human settlers fought each other in the pendulum wars. A brutal struggle for control over a new energy source called Emulsion. After eight decades of conflict, a coalition of ordered governments emerged triumphant. However, victory by the Khan did not bring peace, because a new threat was coming. Just six short weeks after the end of the Pendulum Wars, Locust! the vicious Locust Horde erupted from underground caverns, slaughtering everyone in its path. Locust troops have breached the courtyard. We're on it! What became known as Emergence Day was the start of a new conflict, one for which the human race was in no way prepared. Imagine that. Serving as a gear in the COG army, Sergeant Marcus Phoenix became a fixture on the front lines of the Locust War and a legend to other gears. Well, that's one thing we agree on! For ten years, Phoenix fought in battle after battle. His stature only grew when he was imprisoned for disobeying orders after a futile attempt to save his father, Professor Adam Phoenix. I've come to get you out of here. I've got to save my research. Four years later, a desperate cog put Marcus back on the front lines. Welcome back to the army, soldier. Humankind oh, yeah. was losing ground. That was before Dom turned into a whiny bitch. Only one stronghold remained. The capital city of Jacinta. Then... On a mission into the heart of Locust territory, Phoenix made a shocking discovery. The Locust Horde was actually fighting a two-front war. Exposure to the emulsion energy source had transformed ranks of the Horde into a new threat, the Lambent. These monstrosities had been attacking the Locust for years, and so it became clear. Emergence Day was not an invasion. It was the Locust's attempt to escape an even more deadly foe. They're desperate. All this time, we never realized that. 
realizing humanity would never be able to defeat both the Locust and the Lampin by conventional means. I'm sorry. Phoenix proposed a radical solution. We need to sink Jacinto before the Locusts leave, not after. By sacrificing the last remaining human city, oceans would flood the underground caverns of Sarah, wiping out the Locust civilization. Two years later, human, locust, and lambent survivors alike battled for resources on the surface. <laughs> so much for diplomacy! Marcus was sent on a new mission after a mysterious message revealed his father was alive and in desperate need of help. It was a terrible price to pay. Adam Phoenix had used emulsion on his own cells to study their devastating effects. And soon, father and son were torn apart for a second that and is final so weird. time. Alone in mourning as the world celebrated the end of